Hey guys, and welcome back to Lifestyle, Lifestyle of, of the, the Plebe and Nameless. I'm Joan. And I'm Coco. We're gonna be taking you to Home Depot and a really amazing nursery that we found in Houston. They have so many cute things there, we can't wait to show you. But let's go ahead and get started with Home Depot. I've never seen them being so organized before. If it's your first time here, welcome to our channel. And make sure you hit that subscribe button and give us a follow. We do lots of plant videos on this channel. So you see tall plants at these big box stores, but this time at Home Depot, they're so organized. Like this whole section right here are palms. And this one is a cat palm. I've never heard of a cat palm. Me either. Uh, it looks like a majesty palm. Are they the same thing? I don't know. They're $19.98. For the size, that's a really good price. Look at this ficus right here. It's in a tree shape already. Big leaves. Let's see how much this one is. This fiddle leaf right here is $45. That's a really good price for this size. It's taller than you, Joan. It is. <laughs> I remember when these used to cost like $200 for one this big. The prices have come down a whole lot. We've also got these shorter ones. And these are $20. These look really healthy. They look like they just got them in. Mm -hmm. Still on the rack. Brand new. Got some snake plants here. I'm tempted to get a replacement snake plant. It's only $17. And it's a really, really full basket. And we're already bringing in the fall colors with the crotons. These are huge. These are $40. They have an exotic angel hanging display here. Oh. Ooh, it's a princess. And guess how much this is? $20? Yes. Yeah, that's that's always how much this size costs. Really? <laughs> yeah. But, have you not noticed with all the shopping we've done? But this one is so big. That's how big ours was. Remember I split it up. Ours did forest. not look as full as this. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. Well, this one is huge. So this is a Hoya Crimson Princess. And it's got a lot of white in here. And if it gets sunstress, it would turn a little bit pink. So pretty. We got some pokers. It's a Yesenia? I thought it looked a little bit different. Yeah, I don't think I've seen a Yesenia before. It's like a different shade of green, like a light That's really shade. Pretty. And they have lots of variegations, like from super light to like the darker green. I love Puffos. That's really cute. So they have like the Trandoscantias mm -hmm. and these hanging baskets. And this one is fuzzy. It's green and then purple in the back. $20 as well. I like Trandoscantias. I have the pink Nanooks at home. A purple Trandoscantia. It's like purple and then it's got like silver. Yeah. It's really neat, the colors on this one. Oh, we fig in an arrangement too with some photos down on the bottom. This one is $99. So it's a much better deal just to buy the fiddle leaf fig by itself and get you some photos. Put it together on your own. Oh, these aglianemas are so pretty. Look how red they are. Are these the aglianema siams? I want to say that's what it is. They are $12. Aglianemas are so nice. 
they don't need that much care. You can kind of just forget about watering sometimes and it'll still survive. <laughs> look at these adorable ponytail palms. Aren't they so cute this size? They would look so nice on a desk in an office. They are $12. I would get distracted by it though. Like I want to do this all day. <laughs> They do have these smaller snake plants for $12. But I tend to like these more. The one with the yellow edges. I think so, they I do too. look brighter and more colorful. Look at this cute hurricane fern. It's got a nice pot that it comes with ceramic. How much is it? It's $20 from Proven Winner. You know, this one's actually the most like stylish one I've seen. Yeah. It works well with the tall pots, like mm -hmm. the tall and skinny ones. It looks ones. really good like that. We got some Birkins in the same pot, same price. Ooh, what are these? This one is a philodendron hybrid. I wonder what hybrid it is. Rain Princess? For looks... $20. Pretty nice. I don't think I've seen this before. Mm -hmm. I'm it's telling really you. wet. They just, oh, that's too heavy. It's, it's flooded. Ooh, this one's pretty. And it's only got three leaves, poor thing. That's the style we're going for. Is it Alocasia Amazonica? And the leaves are super skinny too. Mm -hmm. Small and skinny. If you like the minimalist aesthetic, this will go for you. Look, it's a baby Monstera Deliciosa. It's really cute. Yeah, so it's kind of like growing hydroponically. Yep. And then this one is the Birkin, baby Birkin. And there is an Anthurium hybrid as well. Ooh. I would not have guessed that this was an Anthurium. Well, I know it's an anthurium because of these brown edges. Oh. <laughs> Even in water, it's still going to brown. <laughs> ah! You guys, look what Joan found. Oh my god. It's a philodendron Rojo Congo. This one is $30. I'm guessing these are the ones where like the leaves get big. Kind of reminds me of like your pink princess with like the pink stems. Mm -hmm. This one's more red. Makes sense, the Rojo part. Yeah. Okay, but I'm not done yet because I found some good stuff up here too. So what is this one? Ooh, it's got an American flag on it. It's a patriotic one, Joan. Alocasia Lauder Bacchiana, $30. This is very stylish. It is. Like, look at the leaves. It's like the leaves will poke me in the eye. <laughs> Very pointy. And I like the um, the stems too. It looks like very wild, you know? No, I don't know. <laughs> like it feels very like camouflage -y, a wild oh. look. Oh my gosh, this is a different one. It's that one, Jim. I'm so excited. I'm We're finding new stuff. The leaves, it just kind of goes everywhere. Oh my god, is this the stingray alocasia? I think that's what this is. Oh wait, wait, it does say mythic stingray. Oh, okay. Look, <laughs> it's I'm right good, there. Guys. I'm good. <laughs> because look at the leaves. They look like stingrays, right? They do. It's shaped just like that. How did it get to be like so that? So cool. This is thirty dollars. I've seen these before, but I never thought I would see it in a big box store. <laughs> that's amazing. Wow. Look at this thing. Tell me that's not a snake thing. So cool. And they've got these that are like about to unfurl. I just really like the, the stems. It looks like snake. Like a reptile. This one is the Alocasia capuata. Cute. So many new things here. This leaf is the best out of all of them. So shiny. 
So what are these hanging baskets over here? They look like string of rubies. Or the ruby necklace. It will turn like reddish purple, the leaves, when it gets a lot of sun. They're $12, the purple flush. These are string of bananas for $12. They have so many. They look so healthy too. Look at this arrangement here. $37. And it's full of stuff. We got the campfire succulent. These are so cute. They look like jelly beans. Mm -hmm. That's what but I'm, I'm not sure that's what it is. They look delicious. The paddle leaf palancoes, natureberias, elephant, bush. And in the middle is a big old snake plant. This one's worth it. They would look so nice out on a front porch. Yes. Prickly pears. These are great because I think they can go down to like freezing temperature and not die. Oh, that's outside. good. Plant it out in the snow. And this one. This one caught my eye. Look at the shape of the pot. I just like the pot. I want it just for the pot. It is twelve fifty. These pots right here caught my eye. They're so adorable. These are eight ninety eight. They've also got like the bigger versions of those pots right here, $25. And it's in arrangements. Okay, so you can have like a baby and a mama. All right, we're here at another place in time, Houston, Texas. This is another nursery that's like nestled in a neighborhood, but I think they have like a nice little parking area for you. So. And it's a very cute store, so I can't wait to show you. I was looking through their Facebook page and it seems like they have like weekly sales going on. Oh, nice. So nice. let's go inside and see if we can find some good deals. That is such a good deal for hens and chicks. Three dollars. The porter cola. That's the porter cola. These salvias are so pretty. Chocolate mint? Does it taste like chocolate? And mojito mint. You know what that one's for. Mm -hmm. Veronica, what a beautiful name. Oh, look at how cute. Wow, these are like little pot huggers. They got little geckos and turtles. That's adorable. And a raccoon. Wow. Love it. There's more up here. Oh, it's a bunny. I need a hedgehog. I want one. All right, that's enough cocoa. Okay. <laughs> and some begonia maculata, the measles. They're called exotic begonias. I mean, they are exotic. Oh, and they're kind of flowering right here. Ooh, that's so pretty. Ooh, more begonias right here. These are actually really big. All kinds of begonias. They're only $12 for four inch pots, but the leaves are huge. Some vintage pottery. Mm -hmm. 
Got the Hoyas here. Got a Fulia. Hoya Lucky Nosa. Hoya Mephila. Hoya Win Yum Yai. Crimson Princess. This one I can't say. Ooh, it's a Hoya Ratusa. I've never seen this one. <laughs> Very gated vanilla orchid. $22. This one is so pretty. Didn't we see a vanilla orchid at another plant place we went to and it was a hundred something dollars? $22 yes. here. And here's some Hindu rope, $35. Hoya Australis, $40. I love how it's trailing up. It's very pretty. Yeah. I know, I saw their staghorn farm. Definitely coming here to get me one. This one's actually 35. It's not bad at all. Yeah. That's such a good thing. Now I know where to go when I need to get one. This syngonium right here, it's variegated. It's hanging a lot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's trying to escape the pot. It's $38. I don't know what type this is. Panda. Panda syngonium? Mm -hmm. Nice. I like this leaf. It's very cool looking. And here's some syngonium starlight. It's a brown spider wart. It's basically covered with tiny little hairs. It feels like a kiwi, but hairier than a kiwi. Like it's all filled with hair. Touch it, touch it. Oh, you're right. The front and the back side. Uh -huh. Both sides of the plant. And this one is $20. It says it's a cousin to Trinoscantia, which I can see a little bit. There's more staghorn ferns here. The 
Buddha belly. The Buddha belly. Look at the trunk. The leaves are cute. It's only $15. That's mm -hmm. such a good deal. You should get one. And then they flower. Mm-hmm. Oh, those are some big nanooks. Here we have some ZZs. This is $20. Here's a Schifflera elegantissima. It has really narrow leaves. Look at these. They look like, like crocodiles. Oh, I'm thinking of like reptiles. <laughs> okay. But yeah, they look like teeth. I guess I'll take them off, $15. I love the bright green leaves. Ficus pedideris, $15. Bear claw. They're huge. They're really big paws. I like them. I like these Euphorbia Lactea. They're crusted, which is why it's shaped like this. They're $30. So pretty. Here's another kind of Euphorbia. This one's flowering. They look so different. Yeah, there's lots of different kinds of Euphorbia. Is this still considered like a cactus? This one is called Thornless Crown of Thorns for $12. This is a good one to get because they won't poke you. This snake plant here is really pretty. It's called a Sansevieria Mivia or Maya. $76. But look at this whale fin here for $100. And they have a variegated one over here for $75. They have their homemade potting mixes here. So these are called pineapple lilies. That's really pretty. Do they actually grow any pineapples? But the flowers are huge. And it comes off of this huge like stem. Calocasia Maui Gold, $45. Lots of peppers here. This one's called a variegated Thai shoe pepper. Oh, that makes sense because the leaves are like kind of variegated. Very pretty. Probably very hot too. And there's also a little gift shop here. It's like a little antique slash Christmas gift shop. It smells nice in here. Lots of different candles here. I feel like these would be great gifts. Mm -hmm. Paris. Maybe mm -hmm. Yeah, you could gift them. Okay, I thought you said candles. Oh, I did I? I'm sorry. <laughs> I feel like I understand why it's called Another Place in Time now because walking in here just transports me to Christmas season. It's a whole Christmas store. I love this. Yeah, that's why I'm saying maybe this is why it's called another place in time. Yes, because it's always December in here. <laughs> this is like a little peacock. It's like a clipper as an ornament. So nice. <laughs> Also, a little sushi tray right here as an ornament. Doritos. Thanks for coming along with us for another plant shopping adventure. If you enjoyed watching this video, please give us a thumbs up. 
and make sure you hit that subscribe button to join our channel. We also have um, Instagram and TikTok at Pleba Nameless. Follow us for more content. We'll see you guys next time on Lifestyle, Lifestyle of the Pleba Nameless. Bye. Bye. We found a lot of great stuff at another time and place. Is that what it's called? Another time and I place. I thought it's another place and oh, time. Oh, sorry. <laughs>